Signups are now open for Pikeville Police Department's first softball tournament. The tournament will take place at the YMCA softball field on August 24th at 9 a.m., with teams requiring a minimum of 10 players, two of which must be women. All funds from the tournament will directly support Christmas with a first responder in December. The police department has put a softball team together this, uh, this year just for something for us to be able to do to hang out outside of work and everything, and we've really enjoyed it. So it come to us, you know, we put into a couple different tournaments. We was like, we could definitely put one of these together to raise money for Christmas with a first responder. Uh, normally we only have our 5K block party that we fundraise from um, alongside of our donations from sponsors and everything. And so I know, I think we shopped for 92 kids last year. So I'm hoping that along with this, uh, our softball tournament, we can well exceed that. Uh, I believe our clerk uh, informed me that we put back, I believe, $42,000 uh, into the community through our outreach program last year. So I'd like to surpass that this year. And I think this softball tournament's gonna be able to really help us uh, do that this year. Do you worry about having enough money to last throughout retirement? Give Reed Potter at Raymond James a call. Reed has 26 years experience helping folks enjoy their best life in their retirement years. The department is also looking for volunteers to help the games run smoothly throughout the day. For any additional questions or to sign up as a team, contact Pikeville Police at 606-437-5111. They can reach us here at the police department. They can reach out to me. Uh, they can call us at the police department 437-5111 or they can just stop in and talk to us. Uh, we're definitely looking for volunteers. We're going to need several umpires to help us out. And anybody that would like to volunteer, help us out, do that. Keep up with score, uh, anything like that. They can just give us a call, come by. They can talk to me about it. We can definitely set something up with them. And if somebody's interested in putting a team in, uh, they can also stop by or they can reach out to me. We have a form that they can fill out and you can either pick it up, drop it back off to me later, or you can fill it out here at the station. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.